Hello, my name is Miss Kim with the Fort Worth Public Library. I'm here today with you standing in front of the Botanic Gardens. We're going to be learning about topiaries. Did you know that topiaries are bushes and shrubs that have been cut and shaped into the shapes of animals? Today's topiaries look like elephants. Let me show you what the sign language sign is for elephant. Elephant. Can you try that? Get your hand. Elephant. So now that we've learned the sign language sign for elephant, let's read a book about elephants. This is one of my favorite books about elephants. And luckily for us, it's also about topiaries. Let's go ahead and see the title. It's called Grandpa Green, and the author is Lane Smith. This is a wonderful book. He was born a really long time ago. Before computers or cell phones or television. Ooh, let's walk down the path. He grew up on a farm with pigs and corn and carrots. Yum! I think this looks like a carrot. Do you? In fourth grade, he got chicken pox, but not from the chickens. <gasps> he had to stay home from school. So he read stories about secret gardens and wizards and a little engine that could. In middle school, he stole his first kiss. Can you make that sound? Mwah! <gasps> After high school, his wish was to study horticulture. That's when you study plants. But he went to a world war instead. Hmm. He met his future wife in a little cafe. When the war was over, they were married. Wow, look at that topiary. It looks like a cake. They had many happy years together and never ever fought. At least to hear him tell it. Wow, look at all these topiaries that look like him. They had kids, way more grandkids, and a great, great grandkid like me. He used to remember everything. Now he's pretty old. And sometimes he forgets things, like his favorite floppy straw hat. Oh, he left it on the elephant topiary. But the important stuff, there he is. It's a big page. He remembers. Wow, look at all of the fun topiaries. The end. That was such a fun story. Now, let's learn some more sign language signs. This song has that same word, elephant, and it also has spider and the word play. Let's go ahead and sing a song about elephants on a spider web. Ready? One elephant went out to play along a spider web today. He had so much fun, he called another elephant to come. How many do we have now? One, two. Remember elephant. Two elephants went out to play upon a spider web today. They had so much fun, they called another elephant to come. Now how many do we have? One, two, three. That was a great song about animals and nature. Let me teach you one more sign language sign. This time, the sign is for plant. You're gonna take one hand and take the other one and grow it. Plant. 
Someone who really likes plants is Kat Golden. She works at the Fort Worth Botanic Gardens. Can you wave and say, hi, Miss Kat? Hi, Miss Kim. Hi, friends. I'm so happy that you were able to read the story to us. Thank you, Miss Kim. Nice to meet you, new friends. My name is Miss Kat. I am here in the Fort Worth Garden. This is the sign for plant, and this is the sign for garden. I'm so happy that you're here today. We're going to learn about topiaries. A topiary is when you take the form of a shape and fill it with plants. And that's what we're doing here with our friends, the elephants. Can you do the elephant sign for me? Wow, let's try that again. You're putting forth the trunk. Good job. So now I'm gonna tell you a little story that happened a long time ago before you were born. We had a friend, her name was Queen Tut. She's an elephant. And she came to this part of the garden and she stomped down trees. She stomped down logs. She even moved rocks with her long trunk. And when she was finished, she got a drink of water and she walked back up university to her home in the Fort Worth Zoo. Remember, she was a hero around here. I'm so thankful that you came to the Fort Worth Garden today and learned a little bit more about topiaries. Please come back and hear about our friend, the Cardinal. Until next time.